Do you struggle with your times tables? Well, get ready because you're about to smash that problem for good with something completely new that you've never seen before. You won't find anything like this anywhere else. Hello, Internet friends. I'm Lee Cook, the guy they call the Number Ninja. If you're new to this channel, thank you so much for popping by. It's all about helping you get really good at math using my unique Number Ninja system. If you love learning through simple pictures and stories rather than memorizing things like multiplication tables, then this is perfect for you. So if you're interested in that, you might want to hit the subscribe button now and the notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on any of this good stuff. So this video is in response to a question from Jasmine251 who asked, My son gets so upset with times tables and it's really holding him back. I hated these when I was at school, but it's even worse watching him suffer like this. When he goes to bed in tears, I end up crying too because I really feel his pain. I've seen some of your videos and your approach looks like it could really work for him, but I don't know where to get started. Please can you help? Thanks, Jasmine. I know that pain. And this video is going to really help you. Try watching this video with your son. In fact, this goes for anyone else out there too. So if you're a parent with a child going through this, then try watching this together. Hey, even if you left school years ago, but you're still embarrassed about this stuff and are fed up with how it's holding you back, then it's not too late. This is also for you. So let me know your story and how this helps you. Or maybe you're a teacher and one of your kids has told you about this and you're here to check it out for yourself to see how you could use my system to get your whole class flying through their times tables and more in one week instead of the three to four years it normally takes to memorize those answers up to 12 times 12 the traditional way. And for getting your question featured today, you've got a free copy of my Number Ninja game and the full video course coming your way. So keep those questions coming, guys, if you'd like one of those too. Now, the reason why most people struggle with times tables is because they try to memorize all the answers. But you don't need to do that with my system, as I'm going to show you right now. So what's coming up? I'm going to be showing you how to crush any multiplication up to 12 times 12 without memorizing any of those terrible tables of answers. So you can kick that problem right out of the park for good. I'm going to show you how to multiply way beyond 12 times 12 in your head using the exact same system. I'm going to be walking you right through my simple three step process and each of my picture stories to show you exactly how every one of them works. I'll be telling you how you can learn my whole Number Ninja system at your own pace and practice it and test yourself and get certified as a Black Belt Number Ninja with my video course, Master Mental Multiplication Without Memorizing Tables, that comes with a digital copy of my Number Ninja game. And I'll be telling you how you can grab one of those video courses and games for yourself for free as I've set aside a huge stack of these as a mass giveaway for viewers of this video. And I'll be telling you how you can get to play my Number Ninja game with me right here on YouTube for free during some live stream coaching sessions. So if you hate memorizing tables, be sure to stay tuned and listen up as there's tons of stuff you don't want to miss out on. This is really going to help you. I'm going to be giving you so much valuable content today. You might want to take some notes and save this video to your watch later list so you can come back and go through it again when you've got less distractions around you. I'm going to take you right through my whole system from start to finish. Now, that's quite a lot of ground to cover in one go, and I know some of you prefer shorter videos so you don't get too overloaded. So I'm breaking this recording into a series for you, and this is the first video in that series, so this is the right place to start. That way you can watch as much as you like today and then make a note of where you're at to pick up from next time you tune in. And in case you like your videos really short, I've even broken this first First video into a mini series of highlights for you so you can cover this content in just a few minutes at a time. If that would suit you, then click on that card in the corner up there now to view those highlights instead. I'm trying this format out for this recording to give you a choice about how much to take in in one go, and I'd love to know if it works well for you, or if you'd prefer me just to go back to the full length videos. So let me know in the comments below. If you prefer the five minute highlight videos, just write short in the comments. And if you prefer everything in one long full video, even if that runs to 90 minutes or more, just type long in the comments. 
And if you prefer something in between with that content broken into a series of, say, 25 minute videos, then type medium. If you really don't mind whatever length they are, you can type any. Uh, that'll help me get this right for you in future. So here we go. This is how it works. It's a simple three step process. The first step with any multiplication is to spot the fastest key to solving the problem. It'll be one of the numbers in the problem or the X in the middle. My system teaches you how to do that easily. The second step is to link the key you chose to its special picture, which as you'll see is really easy too. And lastly, you just use the story related to the picture to get quickly and easily to the answer. Now, if you've not already seen any of my videos about those simple picture stories, be sure to check those out either right here on this channel or the more detailed ones over on my number.ninja website. You'll see how with just a few stories, you can multiply many problems. And I'm not just talking about those up to 12 times 12. You can use these for many problems way beyond that. Let me show you some examples. Let's start with 10 times nine. You'll learn it's much quicker to multiply by 10 than by nine. So we choose 10 as the key. Now the picture for 10 is a snail. Can you see how that snail looks like a 10? Well, all of my pictures have an easy link like that. Next, we play the snail story in our heads using the other part of the problem, the nine. So in our story, the nine is a snail who lost his shell. So we just need to pop one on. We pop a zero on the end to make nine zero, 90. That's our answer. Of course, the snail works for any whole number as large as you like. For another example, let's try 11 times 12. You'll learn that 11 is the fastest key here, as the 11 story is quicker than the 12 story. The picture for the 11s is the sandwich. Do you see how that sandwich looks like an 11? Like I said, there's always an easy link like that. And so for step three, the story we run in our mind is to make a sandwich using the other part of the problem, the 12. It goes like this. We put the one and two on the slices, and then for a filling, we add one and two together to get three. So we have one, three, two. Our answer is 132. If you've ever tried to memorize the 11 times table, then you may have thought that 11 times 12 was hard to memorize, but you've just seen why you don't even need to remember it. And yes, it'll work for 11 times 11 as well. You break the two ones apart and you add them together to make a filling of two, giving you one, two, one, 121. In fact, it'll do a whole lot more too. You see, most of those kids at the top of your class may have no problem remembering those answers up to 12 times 11, but they're often stumped by problems like, say, 11 times 53, which you could now work out in a flash in your head, even if you never saw that problem before in your life. In step one, you'd spot that 11 is the key. In step two, you'd remember that the 11 looks like a sandwich. And in step three, you'd simply make a sandwich using the five and three on those two slices of bread. The story leads you to simply create the filling to put in the middle by adding those two numbers together. Go on, why don't you see if you can do that right now and pop your final answer down in the comments below. And don't cheat. I mean, feel free to check your answer on a calculator after you've done this in your head. But notice how much longer it'll take you to do that compared to just looking at the problem and calling out the answer. You see, running up these three simple steps is quicker to do than fetching your calculator to work it out for you. Of course, you can also make a sandwich very easily with those smaller numbers up to nine. The easiest way to think about those is to just put that number on both slices of bread and forget about making a filling. That's quicker and easier than putting nothing on the left slice and making a filling out of the number on the right plus the nothing on the left. And you can also make sandwiches with much larger numbers as well, like three or four digits long, or even more, which I'll come back to in a moment. But before we do another example, do you see how simple and powerful these steps and stories are? You may have come across some methods like this sandwich before, but this is the first time you'll see a complete set of pictures that cover the whole of your times tables and beyond. 
And it's also the first time you'll find a system that uses these three simple steps to help you quickly choose which story to run with. Now you've only seen a couple of those picture stories so far and the rest are short and sweet just like these two. Can you see yourself using a system like this to get really good at multiplication without all the effort it takes to memorize those tables? And remember, you can use these to solve all of the basic problems in all of your times tables, but you'll also discover how to use them to go way beyond those problems and solve much larger multiplications in your head too. Like, you'll be able to make sandwiches really easily with any number you like, no matter how big it is, using just a couple more easy secrets for more complex fillings. One for making fillings with those extra digits and the other for handling situations where you add any two digits together and get an answer higher than nine. Armed with those extra secrets, you'd find it almost as easy to handle problems like 11 times 867 without breaking a sweat. What will your teacher and classmates think of you then? You'll even shock your own family and maybe surprise yourself, especially if you've been struggling with these for some time now. But since that goes way beyond the tables you need to learn for school, I'd like to move on for now to cover more of the basics for you. Those extra secrets are the kind of thing you can choose to do in my full video course if you'd like. These kind of skills aren't just a cool party trick, and they're not just something to help you in other areas of math through school and college either. These skills are much more than that. They'll make you street smart so you don't get ripped off with your money. And also, when you're looking for a job or promotion, this kind of smartness can really give you an edge, opening doors to you that are often reserved only for the very brightest applicants. But with this system, you're really going to stand out, even brighter than many of them. How cool is that? Hey, maybe your parents could do with this too, especially if they'd like to get a better job or handle their money more smartly. So if you like this number ninja system, do stay tuned as we work through my other picture stories together. And if you'd like to get the whole system with tons of examples, you can grab one of those copies of my full video course, which is a great video series that covers everything you need to master this system, as well as plenty of bonus videos covering many other math skills too. It also comes with a digital version of my Number Ninja game, which is a great way to have fun practicing your new skills by playing the game alongside the course. When you use these terrific tools, they're guaranteed to get you fully skilled in all of your tables up to 12 times 12 in six days or less with just a few minutes of playing each day. And then you get awarded a certificate to show that you are officially a black belt number ninja. So if you're enjoying this quick intro, you'll absolutely love that. Now for our next example, let's just briefly review that first step to make something really clear to you. You see, it doesn't really matter with any of these problems if you don't choose the fastest key, as you'll still get the right answer anyhow. But I show you how to choose the fastest key, as you'll get to that answer quicker. For example, you've seen how the snail works for tens, and how the sandwich works for elevens. So which one would you use if you had to do ten times eleven? Would you find it faster to do that snail story and put a zero on the end of 11 to get 110? Or would it be faster to make a sandwich with one and zero on those two slices and then adding them together to put another one in the filling? You see, you still get to 110, but the snail was much faster. Now we've looked at the 10s and 11s just so you can see how my system works. And it's just as easy to use this system with those so-called harder tables too, like the 6s, 7s and 8s, which we'll be looking at next. But before I move on to those, I want you to fully grasp how these three simple steps make my system unique. You see, if you're trying to memorize mm. answers, you're trying to jump straight from the problem to the answer by memory. And that only works after you've memorized all those answers. With this system, you just take those three simple steps each time and they lead you straight to the answer, even for problems you've never handled before. Uh. And then for the ones that you keep coming across, you end up remembering a lot of the answers anyhow. So this is a great way to get those answers into your head quickly and easily so that you can leap up those steps if you want to. But this way, you'll always have those steps to fall back on in case you're not completely sure of your answer. 
Do you see how this makes it really easy for you to master these problems without having to memorize those dreadful tables? And would you like to give my Number Ninja game a try during a free live coaching session here on YouTube? I'll give you details about that in a moment, but first, if you like what I'm sharing with you here, and you'd like more of this kind of thing, smash that thumb button to let me know that you're finding this useful. And leave a comment below too to let me know what you particularly like about this approach. While you're there, tell me a bit about your story, what you're struggling with and what pain that's causing you, so I can see what else you'd like help with, and maybe you'll get featured on a future video too. Okay, so would you like to play my Number Ninja game right here in a free live coaching session? Because I'm hoping to be able to invite you guys to come and join me for some of those soon. And I want to be able to do this for you without having to charge anyone for that coaching. So I'm going to need to get these sessions sponsored. Not necessarily by you, but that would be cool if you're able to support them. I'll be offering sponsors some great incentives to support these events, including free copies of my video course and game. But for now, just let me know if you can see my sponsor button, because as soon as that shows up, I can start looking for sponsors. YouTube will only add the sponsor button to my channel once I have enough subscribers, and here's how you can help me achieve that. If you found this useful, you're bound to know someone else who this might help too, so please take a moment to share this video with them, because they'll be pleased you introduced them to this. And the more people this gets out to, the better, so we can get enough subscribers on board to offer that live coaching to you. Okay, back to my system. So far I've shown you my three simple steps and two of my picture stories. That gives you a quick overview of how my system works. And if you're still watching right now, you're probably wondering how this would work for some of those tables that are much harder than the 10s and 11s. So we're going to dive right into those. Up next I'm going to show you how to use my musical note picture story when multiplying by 6. Then we'll have a look at some of those other nasty tables like the 7s and 8s which many people dread, but you'll be amazed at how easy all of these are with this system. I'll pop a link to that next part of this video series somewhere on this screen at the end as soon as it's ready. But if you're watching this video before that link shows up, it's because that video is still being edited, which would mean it's not quite ready for you yet. But be patient, I'll be uploading that next part very soon, as it's the very next one in this video series I've been recording for you. So be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be alerted as soon as it goes live. But before you watch that, here's something very special for you. I'm giving away a heap of copies of my Number Ninja game and the full video course right now. That's a £97 value. And as you've already seen, it's very powerful and the course alone contains hours of really useful content. And this is all digital, so you can get all of this no matter what country you're in. I'm doing this because I really want to grow this YouTube channel and I'm hoping this crazy giveaway will make you want to take a couple of minutes to share this video with all of your friends. So I've set aside a huge pile of these to give away for free and if it works out well I'll even add more free copies to that pile. But it is a limited number so if you want one of these I suggest you go and grab one right away. Of course if any of you are feeling generous and are happy to make a small contribution for one of those to help me keep this whole thing on the road then I'll gladly accept that as I do have a growing young family to support. So I've set it up for you to be able to do just that if you'd like and to choose to pay whatever you like from £30 right down to just £5 for this excellent £97 value training resource. And even though there's no obligation on you to make any kind of gift at all, if you decide later on that this wasn't worth absolutely every penny you chose to donate, then you can get your money back in full without any questions or quibbles at all. So, if you'd like to get one of those free copies for yourself or for someone else you care about, be sure to check out the link to my giveaway right now before they're all snapped up. The link will take you over to my number.ninja website where you can see everything that's included, a heap of testimonials and exactly how to grab a copy for yourself. I'm super excited about this because I get a real kick out of helping people like you. I'm just really excited about this opportunity for you to get really good with numbers. And I'm excited to be here for you, to be able to help you out like this so that you can become a number ninja yourself.